smile all right so i'm back in the chair so you already know what time it is you know what time it is okay let's talk about something real so i wanted to um be very transparent with everybody if you're following a method today i'm covering the bgc wash and go method i want to show y'all what these numbers are looking like the cost now come on so Typically, if you're starting the BGC method, they are going to recommend Innocence products. They're going to recommend the Hydrating Cream Shampoo, Conditioner, and the Icreate Hold. Now, from Uncle Funky's daughter, Curly Magic, that's another gel. They're going to recommend it to you, right? And then a topper, right? Top all that off. They're going to add another gel. So, a lot of times, it may be the trapador that you see. Um, right now, I see some kind of movement on Emba as well. So just know those are additional costs. Now let's run through this, okay? So for the Innocence Hydrating Cream Shampoo, for the 10 ounce is $28. For the Innocence Hydrating Cream Conditioner, for the 10 ounce is $30. For the Innocence I Create Hold 10 ounce is $26. For the Uncle Funky's Daughter Curly Magic Gel, for the 12 ounce is $16. For the type of gel, for the Trepidora Bamboo Ginseng, for 10 ounce is $48, but that is not a US company. I think it ships from the UK. So in total, you'll end up spending $55. So for the regular size to get started with just the products, it's about $155 out the gate, okay? If you are a new client, if you're new to the BGC method, you will end up paying the new client fee. That fee, after I looked through several different um, curly stylists from Florida, New York, California, even across seas, that can range any for, anywhere from $350 to $700 out the gate. So on the low end, we got the $350 plus what you're going to pay for the products. On the high end, you have the $700 plus what you're going to pay for the products okay so i ran the numbers okay so just starting out on the low end you may end up paying 500 dollars or 505 dollars mid about 655 so the average i seen for new clients is around 500 dollars so if you're say if you say oh you know what i want to try the bgc method i'm finding a curly specialist on average what i'm seeing is 500 dollars to get you in the door now, most people, most stylists, they're saying that $500 come with education. It may be two to four hours. I don't see a lot of the four hours. I see two to three hours. Um, once you pay that $500, you'll pay for your products, and then you start your journey, right? So on the high end, if you go to somebody who's charging in the $700 range, you're starting out the gate with $855. That's products, new client price. These are some healthy prices. And I get it, you, you, you're you going to pay for what you want. But my thing is, it would be irresponsible of me to not share this and be very transparent. Because right now, we're in a recession. Times are hard, inflation is high. And I want you to be very strategic on how you place your money, how you move your money. And so I know I've been on YouTube and I've talked about my experience with the BGC method. And you've seen me do some things. So I just want to show you, these are some of the things that I even calculated for myself. And I started to realize, like, these numbers, when you start consistently paying these numbers, it move a little funny, okay? So now, we have the salon sizes. These are the bigger sizes that you'll see in the salon. For the Innocence Hydrating Cream Shampoo, the 32-ounce, $70. The Innocence Hydrating Cream Conditioner, 32-ounce, $80. Innocence I Create Hold, 32-ounce, $70. The Uncle Funky's Daughter Curly Magic, 32 ounce, $50. Trapador is still going to be $55, including shipping. So for the salon sizes, at the gate, you're going to end up paying $325. That makes sense more from an economic standpoint because they're telling you to do this routine once a week. At once a week, you're going to end up replacing those regular size products. Most of those products are averaging in the 20s and up, right? The Uncle Funky's Daughter Curly Magic, you're going to use quite a bit of that. So by the time you buy the 10 ounces, maybe it lasts you for three months, four months, depending on how you use it, probably less if you have more hair. That's going to add up. 
it's going to start adding up very quickly. None of these prices include shipping for the regular size or the salon sizes of the Innocence, the Uncle Funkies, okay? So what does that look like? So if you do the salon size plus the, the new client fee, it's looking like $675 on the low end, $825 on the mid end, and $1,025 on the high end. So when you go online and you start seeing some of the stylists from the Cut It Kinky or the BGC, look at the prices, look what's included in the prices, and then you decide where you want to put your money. I know right now they kind of be like, oh, and why shouldn't somebody pay this? Why shouldn't somebody charge this? You know, people are going to pay for it. Get your money, stylist. You are the customer and you are what's the driving force behind the service and keeping people in business. So you get to decide. Don't let nobody bully you into thinking you need to pay $700 or $500 or however much, however much money is your choice. Nobody knows what's going on in your household better than you do. So please make a financially a uh, smart decision for yourself okay so now let's get into if you're following the bgc method which are curly cuts that's another thing that they push for is curly cuts curly cuts what i've seen whew, for curly cuts if i've seen some stylists recommend eight weeks every eight weeks they want you coming in to get a curly cut curly cuts on a yearly basis from the low end is nine hundred dollars from the high end is fifteen hundred dollars Stylists are charging anywhere for curly cuts, let's see, $150 to $250. Every eight weeks, that's every two months, 12 months in a year, chop that number up, okay? Um, so that's at eight weeks. Now, some stylists will say, hey, every 12 weeks, every 12 weeks yearly, you're looking at $600 to $1,000 a year. So after you've paid the... 155 or 325 for products after you pay for the new service fee anywhere from $350 to $700 then you have additional anywhere from $900 to $1500 depending on the stylist or $600 to $1000 to tack on for the year the numbers are adding okay the numbers are adding up and I just want you to be aware and so now that myself and a few other people who have been following the bgc method previously we come on and we talked about curly cuts and how it's not working you need to blow the hair out now some stylists are offering that service but some are charging anywhere from 50 dollars to 100 dollars. there are additional fees and if your stylist recommends every eight weeks or 12 weeks and you go past that they're charging extra money my previous curly stylist if you went outside that range it was like additional $200. So I just want to make sure that you have the numbers so you can make a financially conscious decision on, you know, doing the BGC method. I'm not telling you one way or another. I just want to make sure I give you these pieces of information, okay? Um, what I will say is that as someone I invest, um, I invest my money in the stock markets, I invest my money in, in other areas. When I went to, when I realized that the economy is starting to go down, because I could see my investment starting to go down, I started looking at numbers. And even then, I started playing with the numbers. What can I do? How can I cut costs? Right? Because I see the economy going like this. Business starts to get shaky. Companies start to do layoffs. I need to be uh, financially responsible. And so when I start looking at the money I was paying into following this method, it just is not feasible. It's not feasible for a long-term period. So for anybody who want to try this, I'm not telling you not to try it, but get in if you do try it, learn what you need to learn, and then get out. And that's for any method. If you see something you like, like how I tried out the Anthony Dickey method, I got in, get, I got what I needed, and I got out because these methods are expensive. They try to push you into a certain product, doing a certain thing. And ultimately, you're going to pay for it. You're going to pay for every additional charge fee. You come late. You want to do this. You want to do that. And then none of these numbers even include, let's say you're new to the method and you have a special event and you go to the salon and have them do your wash and go. That can range anywhere. I think the lowest I might have seen was $100. The highest I seen was $175. So please make sure that you know, you're being financially responsible and you're figuring out the best the best way for you of how to make this work financially. I would recommend getting the salon sizes if you're going to get any of these products. 
because it makes financial sense. But again, please make sure these products and this method is for you. Don't follow the trend. I know you see things on YouTube, but do what's best for you. And that's all I got. Okay. Bye.